Hello guys and welcome to Crypto Wall Sad, but I have to make this video and explain you why I sold all my Avax Avalanche as I think that Avax Avalanche price will drop in nearest future and in this video I'm going to explain you why. this is to do directly with Terra Luna. If you guys for some reason don't know how Terra Luna works, if we go to Terra USD, currently Terra USD or UST, this should be stable coin which should cost at all times one dollar and as you can see currently it costs five times less. This means that if we now will go to Terra Luna then there should be five times more Terra Luna in circulation than it is now. For those who does not know guys when Terra Luna started crashing there were in circulation only about 450 million of Terra Luna. Remember these numbers guys because this is very very important there were only 450 million Terra Luna in circulation when when UST was working as expected and its price was one dollar. So to make Terra Luna work UST should be one dollar and it always should be one dollar. So Terra Luna's USD token or stablecoin it is pegged not only to United States dollar it should be pegged always one to one but this is also pegged to Terra Luna. This is very important to understand because guys many of you will now be jumping into Terra Luna you will be buying it but guys many of you who will do it to my opinion you will lose money even if it costs couple of cents currently you will still lose money if you will be jumping into Terra Luna and Terra USD because I think that this will never recover. This is directly related also to Avalanche as I will explain you a little bit later in this video. But first let's deal with Terra Luna and with UST guys. How much there should be Terra Luna in circulation? If currently UST costs 0.20 cents this means that supply of Terra Luna should be five times more than it is now in circulation to make this cryptocurrency work as expected and to make UST one dollar. Now let's go to Terra Luna guys and like I mentioned at the very beginning of this video when Terra Luna started crashing when its price was hundred dollars or eighty dollars it was only about 480 million in circulation and currently if you will look at circulating supply of Terra Luna then it is 6.5 trillion guys. This is not even Dogecoin where Dogecoin is about 120 billion and in 1 trillion there is 1000 billion. So this is absolutely insane and the absolutely insane amount of Terra Luna has been generated just to make currently the price of UST to be only fifth part of what it should be. And like I mentioned earlier to make Terra UST to be worth one dollar this circulating supply which is currently 6.5 trillion should be five times more just to make this cryptocurrency work as expected. So to my opinion this cryptocurrency is gone and it is absolutely wrecked and it will never ever work again because currently in circulation there is only already 6.5 trillion. Let's take calculator and let's multiply 6.5 multiply by 5 to make Terra USD to be one dollar this will give us 32.5 trillion. So there should be 32.5 trillion or this this price should be five times more expensive which will to my opinion will never happen because of this big circulating supply and why I started by explaining Terra Luna and UST and many of you might ask how it is to do with Avax and why Avax will should crash guys and this is because of reasons that this is the last cryptocurrency which Terra Luna Foundation is still holding. You can find all information about Terra Luna as you see on Luna Foundation Guard. I will leave this link also in description. You can also check it. And currently Luna Foundation, as you can see, Luna Foundation Guard, as these are their hodlings, they have sold all their Bitcoin, so they don't have any Bitcoin on their balance. They don't have any USDT on their balance and they don't have any USDC on their balance. 
they have only this Luna, which is pretty much worthless already, and they have UST, which is also worthless. But they have Avax and they have Avalanche. They have 1.97 million of Avalanche tokens on their balance, which to my opinion, they are also going to sell. And this is exactly the reason why I sold all my Avax and Avalanche tokens. However, I believe in Avalanche project myself, guys. I like that project, but I believe that Terra Luna will be selling this 1.97 million and this will crash the price of Avalanche as well in nearest future. And that's why I think that Terra Luna is broken totally and sooner or later they will be selling their 1.97 million Avax Avalanche tokens which will crash also Avalanche price. And currently Avalanche price Avax price is $33 and I will be following Luna Foundation Guard guys reserves all the time when they will sell when they will crash Avalanche price I believe that that will be the best time to get into Avalanche and I will get back into Avalanche Avax because I really believe in this project but I don't want to take this risk as I understand that most likely I would give 90% probability that when Luna Foundation will be selling they will crash the price also of Avalanche and that's why I don't want to be in this crash. I am better selling. I have many other different cryptocurrencies where I'm investing portfolio to all my cryptocurrencies which I am already starting to stack up for 2020 for in the description of this video go and check them out for yourself guys but i sold all my avax avalanche cryptocurrencies until luna foundation will sell their reserve until they will sell their 1.97 million and they will do it most likely like i already mentioned guys this is just a quick update from me why i sold my avalanche tokens and why i think that they are going to be crashed and why i also think that you a terra usd so as terra luna will never ever recover again this would be much easier to start this project from the start with some working code with something what is actually working rather than continuing with this project so yes this was my quick update on why i think that avalanche or avax price will crash in nearest future hope that you found this video useful leave a like share this video let me know what you think in comments and if you found this video useful leave a like share this video subscribe to my channel if you are new and see you in the next one